wanted to know what was the backstory and what was important, what made this person tick. <laughs> but okay, again, I, you know, someone, you know, said, you know, you give people sugar first. So then you, you know, you hit them with the truth. What are the things that I'm not sure who, okay, ladies and gentlemen, the TV and movies do a bad job. No, we don't, you know, Michael finds, uh, excuse me, Harry finds some sugar in Moore's house. And, you know, he's affiliated with narcotics, blah, blah, blah. Hey, what's in the sugar? We did not, at least I didn't. And I was an investigator, a narcotic investigator back then. I was toward, you know, we had test kits. And if I thought that somebody, something contained illicit narcotics, I put in a test kit. I had a heroin, a cocaine, and a, a, and a marijuana test kit, you know, to, taste the, to test the basic things, what I thought it was. And the fact that Harry, quote unquote, tested it, yeah, that, that didn't happen. Well, it shouldn't have happened. Because as a narcotic investigator, I know what these, these guys, what we call cut the, the, the drugs with. And the, the, uh, they, they cut drugs with some serious bad stuff that, you know, that would kill people. Because they really don't care, especially, some, especially drugs, heroin. It sounds sick and it's wrong, but if you were a heroin dealer and someone died by using a heroin addict died by using your product, that got more play on the street and everyone won that particular package. You know, uh, insight, most heroin dealers had back then color coded their product by the bag or some type of thing that um, identify that's Phil's heroin. And I'm only looking for like one was orange crush. I remember orange crush, orange crush was coming, you know, the heroin came in these little dime bags and it was orange.